What's going on everybody? Blake and Nat here. Today's been an interesting day. Not not a great day. A little bit of a Today has not been a good day. A challenging day for the Albertsons. Parents, I guess. Yeah. And for the kids. So uh let's if you hear them crying and whining, I wanna tell you why. Because it's actually like super sad. But they're like knocked out. They have been for a while. Like there she's she's whining. They had to get three shots today. What was it? Like tetanus, like all these like major diseases that you don't want. And they're in a little bit of pain and they're, they said like they could have a little bit of a fever today. They're going to be fussy and in some pain. And it's extremely sad to watch because there's literally nothing we can do. And do you want to explain the, the situation with Braxton? In the last two weeks which is obviously very alarming she's i mean she's gained a ton of weight so like one ounce is not good so what he does is every time he eats he spits up and we kind of just thought like we've been told it was pretty normal he just had acid so the doctor last time put up put him on acid medicine it's like baby zantac or whatever which i know that adult one was recalled but the baby one was not i don't understand whatever um so we put him on that two times a day and it didn't fix it. It didn't change anything and he didn't gain any weight. So the doctor said that we needed to start figuring out why he's spitting up. And the first thing that came to his mind was that um, I have to go dairy, gluten, and soy free. And nut free. And nut free in order to hopefully fit because the doctor said he probably has a slight sensitivity to all, well not slight a sensitivity blah, blah, to all of that food so he wants me to try this and then if this works which i just hope it does everything's good but we're he also referred us to a gastrologist a gastrologist um to make sure there's nothing else wrong with him. which is super freaky it's kind of, yeah it made me like it really like made me sad because i don't know i feel like i don't know like i just you feel like you're sad. making the milk yeah like i'm making the milk so he's not doing good i guess so it made me super sad but i'm hoping that this will help so we went grocery shopping today how much do they weigh right now eight ten eight, she weighs eight she ten weighs eight ten and he's seven two so, like, obviously now, where there was a one-pound difference, we can see. And you can really see it. You can well, I know, it. but, like, it's always been one pound, but oh, now yeah. it's starting to get, like, a lot more than one pound. Worse than one, not worse, but... A one-pound difference. Yeah. So now it's so almost a two-pound difference. She's, like, in the 50th percentile, basically, for growth and weight and everything. She was 75 for growth. So, yeah, sorry. 75 for growth and 50% for weight. Which is normal. I mean, they were six weeks early, so we do have to remember that. But so that happened. We just need him to hold his weight. We need him but to make. But he was like get literally like heavier in like the what ten percentile yeah. or something like that. So like that is just. And now you can start to see like she's getting a lot bigger, yeah. and he's not. So like we're we're kind of in freakout mode and like yeah. we're going all at it. We spent like so we hundreds and hundreds of dollars today, today on gluten free stuff. Show you everything that I've done. So I can't drink this anymore. I can't drink that, obviously. So that, this is your shelf, basically. So I made chicken, rice. We have asparagus, green beans. So what kind of peas? Snow peas. Snow peas. Cucumber. Or no, yeah, cucumbers, zucchini, carrots. We have salad. Apples, avocados, blackberries, strawberries. Um, I made a big salad and another salad and then I bought like we have this is probably the weirdest thing is the butter like it's made from plants <laughs> so we'll see how that goes and then where's that yogurt oh right here and then coconut milk yogurt so we'll see how that tastes I cannot believe how expensive this stuff is um Kind of ridiculous but like, so we have all that and then like literally snacks i literally cannot take i mean literally cannot eat snacks anymore so like this is what i like these weird <laughs> little 
blueberry bars. These actually weren't that bad, but still. No, I'm not ignoring my kids. Sorry. She's just have like she's like dreaming, and it's so sad. Like she's just hurting. Luckily, he's not yet, and I hope he doesn't. Gluten-free oatmeal. And then this is probably the worst thing, but I'm kind of, I don't know. It'll probably be really nasty. Mm -hmm. But it's gluten and soy-free, dairy and lactose-free. Ugh. All Pareto. We'll see about that. So, Braxton, if you're watching this one day, just know that I'm really trying. That we did this for you. Really trying for you, buddy, so. It's a I'm lot. I'm pretty sad that I don't get to eat pretty much anything, anything. anymore. But... If you're gluten free or anything, like leave some comments with I'd some like tips good food. because right now it's a little overwhelming, I guess. Mm -hmm. And the thing is, is the doctor didn't even like, cause norm. I feel like people will say, well, why don't you just do formula? But he doesn't do good with formula. Yeah. So like, that's not the problem. The problem, he will not do formula. He, he doesn't, doesn't like, like it. He spits it up even worse. Mm -hmm. So that's not even possible, basically. So so, yep. So, little guy over there. It's very freaky. It is. Like, it's scary, all this stuff. It's scary, like... <laughs> Hazley, stop. It's scary. Sorry, Hazley decided to go nuts. Sorry, what were you saying? I'm just saying, it's scary, like, going to a doctor's appointment and, like, think... I mean, obviously, we thought something was with him because he's always spinning up and he's not gaining weight. Mm-hmm. But still, like, I didn't expect it to be... Hazley, come here. This drastic. Right. But it is scary. Like, super scary. Yep. We just need him to gain some weight. Yep. So What'd you say earlier at the project? Project, gain some weight, buddy. Yep. So, I've been cooking. Now i got to clean it all up. I'm wearing my glasses today because I have a hole in my glasses. You contacts. look good, man. You look just real good. Real good. All right. So, listen. This is life, man. Things happen. Not always, it's not always sunshine and rainbows, for sure. So, we're doing our best over here, and uh, everybody hope and wish that uh, things get better with My old Braxton over there. It's just hope and pray and wish that he doesn't have something like super wrong with him. Like it's just wrong. like Cause intolerant. What the doctor stuff. referred us for, you say it, Gast gastrologist, gastrologist, something. I don't know. It's called like the shortened thing is GERD, basically. I don't. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I looked it up, but the treatment for it is a surgery. So yeah, we're really hoping we're not that really. Uh, doesn't have that. We don't really like stuff like that. We don't like medical. We don't like surgery. We don't like. We don't like that word. Yeah. So, so we're really hoping that isn't the case, and that this just a uh, gluten issue or something. Pray for us. Wish us luck. Thank you, guys. All right. Anyways, that's that's what's going on in our house today. It's madness. And, uh, and Natalie. I'm cleaning everything up. Dedication. A mother does everything for their kids, don't they? I, I'm trying. Including, like, literally don't eat anything. I mean, I can't eat any of my favorite foods anymore. It's sad. pretty sad, but it's fine. I can All drink right. water. You can drink water. Water never hurts you. <laughs> All right, that's it. Hope you guys have a good day. Leave us some comments for some good yeah, gluten-free gluten -free meals. And dairy. It has to be no dairy. Glute, gluten and dairy-free. So, know. see you guys in the next one. Bye. Peace.